To Be Able to Fly by Steve Young Every man's dream to be able to fly, to spread your arms and step into the air, to join the birds in their joyous domain, to feel that elation of carving through air. Distant memories still hold true, to hold your arms wide as a child without a care, you run and in your mind rise up to run headlong surge up in the air. Nothing in your view but your playground, the sky, to feel that air mortals imagine void, to feel its texture ripples and waves, to feel its troughs, its surges, its vigour. Few can know the soft, smooth caress of a summer's evening flight on gossamer wings. Scents and songs of a distant planet reach you in a whispered word, drowned out by the enveloping pleasure of your new world. Few can know the power and vigour of an aggressive spring thermal, like a beast awakened, spurred by the engine of the sun, awakened after a long winter slumber. Striving to charge to the heavens above, to find and tame that invisible beast, to feel that surge as you climb on its back, to be as one, riding to the sky above. You are wrapped in its embrace, as you ride it to the clouds, it takes your breath away as you kiss the clouds. To kiss a cloud is a pleasure only few can know. To feel its gentle touch on your face. To know that touch, that smell, that elation of joining with that cloud only you will know. Only you will visit in its own domain to soar, to carve, to play in its embrace. You want to wait a while in this beautiful place to see your shadow on its face. You yearn to relax and rest a while, but there is nowhere to rest in this being's place. It releases its embrace and to your dismay, you slowly descend and depart this place. You begin to look at the vista afar. You realize how very privileged you are.